Qingqi Opera. How do you know what spring is like without a walk in the garden? And how can you know the beauty of Jiangna without listening to Qingqi Opera? As an orchid of Chinese opera art, flowering in the water town of Suzhou, Qingqi attracts opera lovers all over the world. More than 600 years ago. A poet named Gu Jian created the predecessor of Qin Qi, Qin Shan Qiang, based on Nan Qi. After innovations made by Wei Liangfu and others, a tune that absorbed the merits of both North and South tunes, called Shui Mo Diao, came into being. Then it gradually developed into a unique and vigorous opera known to the world. The soft Suzhou dialect, accompanied by string and bamboo instruments, is sung in a strictly stylized way and matched with postures that fit in with the opera text, bringing out a delicate and fascinating performance. The emotional expressions and melodious songs of the stage performers draw the audience into every engaging story. Many plays in Qingqi, such as the Peony Pavilion, the Palace of Eternal Life, and the Peach Blossom Fan, are all ten masterpieces of ancient Chinese opera literature. The legends of kings and generals, the romantic love between literati and beauties, and the love and hate of ordinary people, are all staged in Qingqi. Sincere love rises above life and death, or worldly affairs, and touching stories go beyond history and nations. After 400 years of ups and downs, Qingqi Opera has walked out of the depths of history, fully loaded with the fruits of Chinese culture. The joys and sorrows inside and outside the opera. Are integrated into the songs and tunes, interpreting the many charms of Oriental aesthetics. <laughs>